All right, guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Don't forget to hit the like button, subscribe, and share to all your friends. Um, I made two water bottle fish traps. If you've seen those, you already know what they what they you know look like. But I put one of them over in here, and there's two spots that I I want to put them. <clears throat> And uh, I'll do that after this video. I'll put them down there, leave them for 24 hours like I did these ones. I put 16 conifer pellets in the water bottles, a few pellets, and then put it in the water as, you know, like the bait, the lure. And as y'all know, we have crawfish in the ditch and we have like newts and like uh, slugs and stuff. So I wanna see what, what else we got in here. And um, here's a spot I'm going to do it next, and this one. And for video sake, I already took out because look at this clouds, it's like dark, so I gotta do this fast. But I already took the bottles out, I'm letting the sand, dirt, mud settle back down to the bottom. And here's where I got the second one, or well, the first one at, right here. Now, when I release all the stuff that's in it now, I'm gonna put one on this side right here. So now let's go and see what all's on the trap. I got him over here on the steps. Here's the uh, traps, as you can see. Still a little murky. This one has some rocks in it. I don't know what all is in here, but we are going to find out. Looks like there's some salamanders in it. Uh, I don't know if there's anything in this one. Oh yeah, there's a salamander new thingy. Is that, is there only one? Oh no. But I'm gonna go see if I can get me something to, you know, like cut the tape or something off. You know, like a bucket to put all the stuff in. Let's see what we got. Okay, I got a bucket. Flathead. All right, let's go back over there. I need to the bucket. <laughs> Let me get back over here and grab it real quick. Just don't worry about it. I don't want to get caught out in it. Okay. I'm going to try to set you guys up real quick. some of this water in here. Try to see if we can see what I got. It looks like we got some newts. I don't know if I can see much else. I'm trying to rip off this tape. I taped it pretty good. There we go. There's an edge the corner. Don't litter guys. Don't litter. There we go. Alright, let's see if we catch anything. But we don't really want a lot of water and stuff getting out. Oh, look, 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 look. Two salamanders already. Three, three. Look at them. There's one, two, and three. Mm. 
No way, no way, no way. We caught a little crawfish. I think it's missing a claw. Where'd it go? There it is. Yeah, look, it's missing a claw. I don't know if y'all can see that very well, but look, it's missing a claw. It's a little baby. Let's put that back in the water. Oh, we got something else. Comment down below if you see that or know what that is. Not focusing. I don't know what that is. It looks like a uh, water flea. Comment down below if y'all know what a water flea is. It didn't go into the water. There it goes. I don't see. Oh, oh, we got something else. Comment down below if y'all know what that is. Looks like a little isopod or something. Put that back in there. That's the water flea. It's just floating there. Then there's a little isopod thing. I'm not seeing anything else in that one. Wait, I can see something. Oh, there it is. Oh, guys, look. It's one of those salamanders. Snoop things. Get off my finger, buddy. Go into the water. Yeah, there we go. I don't see anything else in here. But this is all you basically do. You get your water bottle, you cut your top off, you get staplers or tape, I like tape, and then you stick it on here in there like that. That way you got the hole in there like that, that way they can't get out. Now we're gonna try to get the tape off of this one. I'm gonna pour a little more water in there. Thing yet. I ain't seen anything. I'm not seeing anything. Oh, I just seen something. Oh yeah, we caught another isopod thing. Let me try to get that thing out. This one's bigger than the other one we caught. See it? I don't think I see anything else. Yeah, I don't see anything else. Alright, so comment down below what you thought of this video. Um, now we're just going to release them and I'm going to kind of show you the environment of these. I'm going to throw this on the porch so that way it don't blow off. And I can reuse it in the other spots. Okay. So we caught about 10 salamanders, one crawl, baby crawl, and two isopods. Oh yeah, and a water flea. 
see it swimming around right there. It was right there in that corner. You see it? Yeah. Now y'all know how to get that, make uh, the traps they work. They work for minnows and all kinds of stuff. Now comment down below if you want me to do it while I'm fishing one time. Bring, make me a, a really good one and do it while I'm fishing. See if we can catch some uh, stuff for the tank. Possibly some food for the tank too. All right, you guys ready? See if we can catch him. Oh, look, 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 look. See if he'll swim. Look, look. Oh, there's a flip. Oh, there he goes. The crawl got stuck. Some other stuff got stuck, so we're gonna help them guys. Oh, no, come here. I'm trying to help you out. Go on, be free. Watch him, watch him. Oh, oh, he jetted off and he's gone. Anything else in here? Looks like there's an isopod thing. Y'all, yeah, comment down below if y'all know what this thing is, though. Why is it not focusing? Come on, focus. I don't know why it's not focusing. Watch, watch, it's gonna go. Oh, there it goes. Those daughters are fast, man. Oh, there's another isopod. I ain't too worried about y'all seeing that thing go. Um, I don't see anything else. Oh, look, 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 look. Here's those snails I was talking about. I have four of them in my tank. I've got some of those salamander things. So, oh, it's getting windy. All right, I'm going to end this. See you guys in the next one.